welcome back to another Trenton World Free Life. We're back on the New York Trenton route. So here we are at the very delightful New York Penn Station. Uh, uh, I'm going to be running an ACS 64 service down to Trenton and then hopefully for the return we'll go in the Acela, uh, which will be good. So a nice Amtrak themed uh, stream. Uh, let's get in and uh, we'll get the doors open. I've completely forgotten to plug in the keyboard, so let me quickly go and do that, which I should be able to do by stretching over, hopefully. Uh, let's try and whack that in. We've got NG and Bigson at the moment. How are you both? Uh, it's almost there. Come on. Come on, Bigson. 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 Come and yeah, we're going to make our way down to uh, down to Trenton. But yeah, this is uh, this is New York Pen, which looks uh, looks nice. People were saying it looks like it's been copy and pasted from Long Island Railroad, uh, which is a bit of a silly thing to say because it's the same station, uh, and you can tell by some of these these are different to how they are on uh, Long Island Railroad. Um, so yeah, I think it probably has been redone. Or at least some bits might have been copied over, but I mean it's the same station, so. And you got the ALP forty six there, which is always fun to drive. What else we got coming? I can hear something coming in a hint. No, maybe not. Uh, and in this service we're gonna be calling at Newark Penn Tre and then Trenton. So we're actually a really quick service. Wow. I thought we might have been calling out New York Liberty as well. I mean, this is like the same speed as the um, uh, Acela. So <laughs> it's a quite a quick one. All right then. Well, it won't be that quick. Let's get the train set up. Uh, so we've got the HEP. Let's do that to ARM. Needs to be fairly quick as we've already shut the doors. Hello, Ricky. I'm all right. How are you? Get all of that good stuff on. There we go. Uh, let's set that in. Get the bail on, set this up, we're getting ready to move. Uh, passenger, front headlight, ditch light, let's go. Right, we're off. We have got a restrict signal though, so we can't go that quick. Come on train, move. There we go, we're off. Love the uh, neon sort of headlights on. I think, yeah, neon headlights. Sort of blue colour to them. And we're off. Good to hear, Ricky. Good to hear. Oh, that would do. No one's there, so. And out we go. We're doing a nice early morning service. I'm hoping we're going to get it as the sun is coming up, although they're probably not, as I think I've set this one in May or April, so 7 o'clock in the morning is going to be nice and bright. Uh, but we'll see. As we uh, make our way out. Hello, Devon. I'm alright. Hopefully, you're all well as well. Let's open it if it looks well. We're going to pop that down a little bit. There you go. Might get some light coming through there. And it might be quite quiet to begin with, as I doubt YouTube is uh, promoting the stream, as uh, this is our like sixth or seventh thing today. There we go. Hello, ladies Jet. How are you? Hopefully you're all well. So we're not even stopping at Metro Park on this one, which is surprising. There's quite a lot of the services stop there. But I think it's where the Carol uh, Carolinian we're not. We're sort of an extra fast one. Come on. Speed, go up. Don't be mean. There we go. Probably the easiest train to drive on the route, this one. It's nice and chilled out. Unlike the New Jersey transit trains with the lapped brakes. Start safety systems which always catch you out and awesome laser jet. There we go. Hammer off. So 
So I knew it pen next. Let's pop that down. Yeah, this is probably our what? Fourth, fourth, no, probably fifth hour of playing this DLC now. Including well, possibly more than that. So we've done quite a bit of it now. Yeah, we're going to head down to Trenton. And yeah, then we'll go back in the SF. We'll see how it's getting on. If it's quite quiet, we're in that Trenton. But if it's fairly busy, then we'll go back in the Acela. I was thinking about doing the ALP 46, but I think we'll leave that for today. As we did do a fairly lengthy video on that um, earlier. Hello, MTT. How are you? And obviously, big thanks to Dovetail Games for giving us a key to show it off. Giving it a giving it a go. Get up as well. There we go. And yeah, the Union Pacific Heritage Collection we won't be showing off on stream, although we have done a separate video on that. Just as I suppose there's not really much to show on there. Uh, which we haven't already shown, as we obviously saw all the liveries and stuff. I think I'm about to come out of the tunnel. You can see the light at the end as we curl out. Love it. And up to 75. Although this bit's in Europe pens really quite slow, and it's busy as well, uh, so you can't go that quick on it. It's sort of the slow part of the route. Well, that's a nice part of the route. You don't pick the livery pack up. Fair enough. I don't think many people will be getting the uh, heritage pack. Because I think it is, well, it's US freight. And you have to have Sherman Hill to get it. So I think it is, well, not going to be that popular. But I'm sure people will get it. And we've shown it off, so we've done our best. So we're going to be whizzing through to Carcass Junction. <clears throat> yeah, scen uh, this is probably the most scenic part of the route. <laughs> or, well, ish. It pro actually, it probably is the most scenic part of the route. Uh, although it is, well, quite a bottleneck in the slow part of the route. As you've got all the New Jersey transit, all the uh, all of the trains go through this uh, uh, double track here. Hello, little Jack. How are you? Welcome in. About to go through to Caucus Junction. One thing we haven't done as well, we haven't done the Metro on a cab car on stream. We haven't done that yet. Let's put that down. There you go. What's your nickname for this train, Amanda? you got a New Jersey Transit train there, so that one looks like it's waiting for... Hang on. No? I swear I saw a New Jersey Transit train. I must be seeing things. Well, maybe not. There isn't anything there. I thought I saw something. Maybe not. And it comes down to 60 fairly shortly, so let's uh, pop that down. Before it's too late, and before the thing gets angry with us. You're okay, nice. Well, we should start seeing that come down to 60, I think. Yeah, there you go, you'll see that starts um, counting down. So it's, I suppose, fairly straightforward to do this route hudless. I don't think it would be particularly hard to do it hudless. There we go. Going to try and do the cab car without training on it. Awesome. Well, I suppose if you've played it on Train Simul 2020, it's actually an easier setup. You don't have to do the circuit breaker. Hello, Max. How are you? Cab speed 60. And it goes up to 90 for not long. So we'll just take this for now. No point speeding up for the tiniest amount of time. Well, for a mile. 
all the radio masts around here. Some there as well. <laughs> well, the timetable I'm guessing is based off the real one. So if you want about a sort of a, a busier timetable, there's I suppose not really much more which they could do, which would doesn't make it unrealistic. I think the only services they're missing are the um, diesel ones, I think. I don't think there's many of them, I think. Hello, Senseless, how are you? Hello, Tom, how are you as well? Lovely. So pretty much, yeah, exactly the same ACS-64 to the um, Boston Providence one. that down there's another service there New Jersey train oh that's coming down there you go 60 oh hello yes yes you hope this one's well on Gen 8 it might oh you're from this area alright well, how busy is it in real life we might not have all the trains in the game was I correct in thinking there are some package deals for these new releases? Uh, yes, there's bundles for it. The passenger bundle, the super bundle. I mean, like two trains straight after each other. Um, yeah, there's a super bundle, passenger bundle, freight bundle. Alright, Max. Let's put that down. As I was saying, we just don't have the locos in the game for, uh, for those sorts of things. Oh my god, 45. Yes, I know, it's fine. Don't panic, train. This thing really does scream at you when you do something wrong. Fine, I'm good, alright? Oh, good. Afternoon, Richard, how are you? Get that up again. Approach medium. As we come into, uh, you're on your way home from Edinburgh, lovely. Beep, 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 yes! It loves screaming at you, this train. It's a screamer train. Yes, we know. Okay. There we go. <laughs> what's this, 20 now? Probably will be a 20, won't it? Yep, 20. And it's getting foggy. Go away, fog. I want it to be a nice, clear run. I don't know, yeah, we get it, but it keeps beeping at you. Beep, 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 yeah. I'm back up now. On train somewhere free, you're level 257, lovely. <laughs> exactly senseless, but the train's like that. They cut, uh, and they all does pizza B is yeah. They all say pizza B is complicated. Pizza B is much simpler than that bloody thing going beep beep and having a go at us. Hello, Luke. How are you? Why is it going foggy? No. It likes going foggy. I don't like that. <laughs> Let's go cloudy or something like that. A bit hazy. Exactly, planes, exactly. Hello, Joseph, how are you as well? You've got the gen. Oh, lovely, yeah, uh, Richard. Very nice. And we're arriving about four minutes early into Newark, Penn. Oh, C Max. You like the live stream? Cheers. We haven't had rain on this route yet. So I sort, of, I sort of hope we do see rain, as we haven't had that yet on here. Not that it's that exciting, just something a bit different. Why am I putting that on? Not that. B. That's the one. And this is Newark Pen. Can't get the cab cab moving. What one? NJT or Amtrak? And we want aim to stop, I think, on the E, which is a bit further up. 
Yeah, it's the same ACS 64 what's on Boston Sprinter. And I think for tomorrow's stream, we might do... Yeah. Hmm, tomorrow's stream, we could do the... Do the Acela. Maybe. Stop. There you go, that would do. Quite a tough stop, but, you know. Got to be firm with the passengers. Here we are. The Amfleet. Uh, make sure you've done the brakes. Set them to lead. Here we are. And I'll be waiting. Cool. I think tomorrow's stream might do just the Acela. I do the Acela on both parts of the Northeast Corridor. So all four coming in. Uh, yesterday you became a news author on the German Railsim Forum. Lovely, Tom. Very nice. Lovely, Tenseless. So we've got a few minutes here. Actually, whilst we're here for a few minutes, let's um, let's kind of a little run round, see what we can explore. Because on the Train Simul 2020 uh, in Newark Pen, it was quite a, a sort of a restricted station. You couldn't really do much, or couldn't go many places. See if there's any collectibles. So yeah, there's a map. Yeah, there's maps and garbage to um, pick up. Can we go up here? Yeah, so it's still a little bit limited. Uh, maybe, um, Joseph, maybe. Let's go down here, see what we got. So you've got the um, CIS working. Um, you can see on there. How do we actually, how do we get to the other platforms? That wouldn't be, that wouldn't be great if there's no way to, to transfer from platform to platform. Maybe there's a way down here. Let's have a look. Yeah, can't go up there, can we? And we can't. Can we? Can we go down? There must. There must be a way that we can get across the platforms. Surely. If not, that's a little. See, it's still, I suppose, quite a limit. A limiting station. So a, a lot of it's just blocked off. Hello, Crazy Dash. How are you? Can we go down here? Yeah, so there's no way of crossing the platform. Hmm. Same as the TSW 2021. Back in. Well, it probably has been redone, but yeah, still can't get across, though. This is bigger than the original station, but you can use more platforms, I suppose. Yeah, we came in on um, this one earlier, over that side. Just so blimey, I'm a bit of a lay in to say uh, Crazy Dash, fair enough. And then after this, we're straight to Trenton. Um, so yeah, that's quite a long gap. It's saying that will be about 35 minutes, and that will be a, what, 50 miles or so? So quite a long, uh, a long way. Right, what's the button on here that changes it and it's just the, um, uh, not that one. No, there's one where you can just have the um, speedo, I think. Or is it this one? It might just be that one. Possibly. Press buttons. No, maybe it's that one. Cool. Can you walk across the U? You can, but it'll be a bit dangerous. You know when the middle of the main line's coming out? No idea. Nice Jake. Hello Monty, how are you? Right. Let's get the door shut and then we shall make our way 
well, probably for about 50 miles non-stop. They are crazy dash, yeah. 47 miles to Trenton. Wow. Right, well. Let's get that off and let's get out of here. So we're not even, so we're not even stopping at New York Liberty or Metro Park, which is sort of the main stations. Although I suppose probably because we're the um, Carolinian. Hello, Ice. How are you? Off we go. Leaving Newark Pen. That'd be cool, uh, Epic. Maybe they'll do that in future. Leaving Newark Pen behind. Still feels weird playing this part on Trains in Wild 3. As this bit was on um, Trains in Wild 2020. Oh, there's an Acela. Oh, and also an NJT coming in as well. Look at that. Cool. Awesome tees. Does the AC have any sort of sound upgrades that other than the access or no? Don't think so, no. No, uh, I don't think so. Sounds near enough the same. Yeah, so I think for tomorrow's stream, that'll be the next one after this, we'll run the Acela um, from maybe Boston down to Trenton. Sort of in two parts. Try and get the same one as well. There's another, they always seem to come in flurries, the NJT trains. You sort of get a gap of them, and there's like two or three that come at the same time. It's like buses. Don't turn up for a while, then two turn up at the same time. Yeah, so we're not stopping at Newark uh, Liberty. We get to go straight through. I don't know, who knows, Amanda? Quite a few. <laughs> Maybe number four. Hello, SNCF. How are you? Welcome in, and welcome back. So all the way down to Trenton, and then we'll go up in the Acela and go all the way back. Try and find like a quicker Acela. Try and do like the quickest Acela service we can find, just to see how fast that one goes. What stations it skips out. Well, I wonder. I wonder if there actually is like a non-stop run in the Acela between Trenton and New York. Probably not. That'll be cool. <laughs> you can't find the bundles on the PS5. Does anyone know if I can purchase them on the PS5? Someone else mentioned that earlier, Mark. Let me have another NJT. Let me have a look at the um, at the store. Right, there we go. As maybe they're not on there. Someone said they're on Xbox. Let me just look up the US Super bundle, and that might that might come up. No, there is a US Super Bundle on there. At least uh, that's on the um, PS Store. US Super Bundle $79.99. You can pick that one up for. Uh, what else have we got? And then you've got the US Passenger Bundle. US Freight Bundle. Um, yeah. So it's showing up on my one. Or at least on the PC Store. Oh, lovely, yeah, SNCF. Like between New York, Penn, and Boston. Oh. Mix and match. Yeah. Good tier, SNCF. Fair enough, Epic. Bundle, yeah. Try it on the um, PC store. As you could you could log in on your PlayStation account on there, and then buy it through the PC store just on your phone, and then it will then oh my god then it will then transfer. So it's random one of those random 45 sections. Now it will then transfer over to your console. Oh, weird, uh, crazy dash. Why is there a random 45? We've got an approach medium. So it comes out of nowhere. 
I suppose we've probably got to keep an eye on the real signals. I think he'd probably uh, be like, oh yeah, that one. There you go, it's all good. It's very BP. I mean, it's 85 here, not 45. I think these are the Elizabeth to Elizabeth to uh, no, straight back up. It's weird. Uh, not too sure, Sonnen. Streams from Sherman Hill. Uh, I don't know those jet. Oh, I see crazy there. Yeah, see, I think we just passed North Elizabeth Station. And then you've got Elizabeth, Linden. I'm trying to remember some of them. Metachus? No, it's not Metachus after that. I remember Linden. Maybe then that's Railway. No, it's Railway after Linden now. That's all green there, so that's all good. Let's get that up. Slowly learning the stations on here. I suppose there isn't actually too many to know. I think there's like 17 or something. And then up to 125 shortly. There we go. Cool. And then straight down. We've got another train on the way up. It's like another uh, Amtrak regional. Has any route all right like Edinburgh Glasgow? Can't really compare the two. Completely different countries, completely different well it is you can't compare the two. Fair enough, uh, ray gun. There's another train. Of the uh, cab car there. Okay, hundred and twenty five miles an hour. So quite quick. It should be that speed the whole way. <laughs> Fair enough, uh, Crazy Dash. Got an NJT train there, so I mean, it's fairly busy. Asking your questions, Krasner. Um, what's this one? There's the Catan uh, thingy there. Linden. So after this, it's uh, railway, I think. I think of this route compared to Boston Sprinter. Much more, many more stations. <laughs> I'll, I'll just leave it up to you, though. You, you make your mind up. I'll sort of compared to that one and that one. Oh, is there, what's that cra uh, crazy dash? Why are they not in then? Or maybe that's because we don't have the ALP 45, was it? So maybe you'd see them in future. Oh, we've got 110 coming up. So it should hopefully start, yeah, you can see it's bringing us down for that. I think that one's railway there. Reminds me a bit like the Oakville subdivision stations a little bit. Yes, yeah, buzz buzz. And then what was the one after that? Wasn't Metachutin after that, was it? Fair enough, uh, Monty. Ah, oh, zero gun. I don't know the truth in real life, so can't really have a say on things like that. But on we go. Bit of horn. Oh, Buzz. Oh, God, say 45 again. What's that all about? I have a weird 45. Some really weird limits. Well, down we go again. Oh wow. That's weird then.
Are they like different trains which run that or? See, so it will go straight back up in a second. No, but that, why do we slow down? Is this the old train? Well, not old train. This is actually a newer train than the Acela, but yeah, older train in the game. And <laughs> buzz, buzz, buzz. Don't say it's 45 for this here. I think it probably is, isn't it? For this tiny little corner here. No, it's straight and then right back up now. That all about. I mean, hardly a much of a curve. There's the sparks as well. Which, if you have Boston's uh, Boston Providence, you also get the upgrades on there as well. Oh, that's a crazy dash. Well, someone said they only have 29 ALP 46s. So maybe it's a bit like the BML, where they sort of had to create the 377 1 or just renumber them. Because they sort of ran out of numbers. Because then you have the same ones running. Let's see, where you go. Is there a train ahead? I don't think so. That's just for those two corners, I suppose. That'd be crazy dash. So at Elizabeth it comes down to 45 and just south of railway it comes down. This one is Metro Park where some of these services will stop there. Not all of them though. Some of them. And what was after that? Is it Metatude 10 after that? I know from Trent... Trenton upwards, it's like Jersey Avenue, which is southbound only, and New Brunswick. No, no, there was Princeton Junction, yeah, Princeton Junction, Trenton, Princeton Junction, Jersey Avenue, New Brunswick. We'll slowly learn them. Oh, let's see, crazy dash. You're on West Corner, looking up from Penzance to St. Austell, lovely. Try it on the PC store for PlayStation, Luke. You might be able to buy it on there and then it'll transfer onto the console. I mean, yeah, maybe perhaps those missing services will just be added in future. Hello, SERL. How do you turn off light flash on the Metro Liner? There's like controls to the left hand side that should um, sort it sort it out. What do you mean strobe the strobe lights, uh, train boy? Which yeah, the thing will be on the left hand side to turn that off. What's this one here? No, this is it. This Metatutin, isn't it? Metatutin. Matutin, whatever how you say it. Yes, it is. Cool. We're slowly learning. What was the one after that? Can't remember. <laughs> Man, that could have been New Bronze, but not sure. In Train Summer 3, you've got six SD40s. Nice. So it'll be a fairly easy route to do hudless on the fast lines. On the slow lines, not so much. But the speed doesn't change too much on these lines. Uh, I think they're in the game, Crazy Dash. If you mean this, um, if you mean this line up here, I've seen, I've seen, we saw one earlier on stream go in uh, this way. See what the next station is coming up. Only got 29 miles to Trenton now, so it does come down pretty quickly. Very quickly. There we go. 
And I think that's a station coming up. What's this from? I have to have a look. Or is there not? Is there not a station? Am I seeing things? No, I think there is. No? Is there? No, maybe not. Maybe not. Or is there? No, there is a station here. What's this one? I can't remember this one. This one is... Edison. Oh, Edison. So what's after that? Is it then New Brunswick? Uh, maybe they ran out of time, maybe Crazy Dash, or maybe in future they'll add them maybe to next gen and PC only, those bits and bobs. I'm sure there'd be a reason for not having those um, services in. I wish if they knew people were going to pick up on it. I'd be like, where are they? Really getting some speed on us. And then the Acela, I think the top speed on this bit's 150. Well, they're not 150 for long, though. So if you want to run the Acela at really high speeds, you're best off getting it on the Boston Providence route, where it's 150 for, what, 10, 10 15 minutes straight? It's, it's fantastic. Absolutely fantastic. This one's, uh, yeah, that's new, a new Brunswick quite a built up here. It's quite cool sort of on the bridge flying over the area. Quite possibly one of my favourite areas of the route. So we sort of fly over the town. And then it's then Jersey Avenue next, which isn't too far down, but that's the southbound stop only. So if you're going northbound, you don't have to stop at Jersey Avenue. What trains come with a new route? The ALP 46, ACS 64, the Acela, the Metroliner cab car, the New Jersey Transit cab car, and then the Acela if you get it as the DLC. There's Jersey Avenue. Let me go. I've forgotten any there. So next one along is Princeton Junction. 23 miles, which will go down in absolutely no time. Probably actually get there a few minutes early, I reckon. At this speed. But I think I'd, I think I do prefer the fast services on this route. Just for the fact it's just 125 odd miles an hour. And up to 150 if you're in the Acela, which is, is awesome. And plus, because the NJT trains are a bit more of a challenge to drive. Because those bloody lapped brakes. Washington to Baltimore has the Acela on train sim. It does. Yeah, it does on there. Cool. Just to have a little bit of power on, just to sort of try and maintain our speed. We don't want to obviously slow down much. Let's quickly put this in one of our servers. Cool. Yes, buzz, buzz. Still one, two, five. Do you still think the Hudson line is your favourite? You mean the Harlem line? Um, 
Possibly. I don't know. Give me a couple of weeks. Also the Arrow 3, which is used on the Princeton branch. Well, I doubt we'd see that, because I don't think that's modelled, is it? The um, Princeton branch type, type, type. Hey, well, welcome back to Stand the Class, mate. Much appreciated. Feels like it's been absolutely ages because I think your original name was like Gareth, Gareth, wasn't it? On on YouTube. But yeah, much appreciated, mate. Welcome back. Hit the buzz. It's annoying. Look away for one second. You fell. Yes, that was only three miles long. I mean, route extension in future. Never know. Little mini one. Remember the mice and branch. Yeah, well maybe they'll do that crazy dash. You know, uh, 15 quid, you get the three mile branch line and the, yeah, the arrow three. Hey, cheers, well. No worries, SNCF. Well, it's showing on the PC store, or PC PlayStation store. So I suppose if you can't find it on the console store, maybe pick it up on the... Um, um, on the on the PC uh, PlayStation Store dot com. How do I remember? I just do. Was it like Gareth Holmes or something? No, Gareth Walker. No, something. I remember it was Gareth something. I remember it. Hey, Brandon. Welcome in, Brandon, mate. Uh, glad you're having a good time. We are. I enjoy watching you while I have lunch. Awesome. Got anything nice? But can we get some hellos in the chat for Cactus Juice, who is Brandon, who did the uh, the uh, signalling, or that upgraded the signalling systems and etc. But for Boston Sprinter, and I think this route as well, uh, to make it more lifelike, and also made the Long Island Railroad on Train Sim Classic. Sounds good, SNCF. Uh, Pete, Pete, if you're watching, can you see the US Super Bundle on the uh, console PlayStation Store? That's one, well, yes. I think it was Gareth or something. It's available on Xbox. Okay, so Xbox is fine then. So it's just PlayStation, it's not showing. Obviously, make sure you're typing in the right thing. US Super Bundle. Not just US Bundle. It might not, might not then come up. Can't be too far to Princeton Junction unless we've already passed it and I've uh, completely missed it, which is probably. I oh, know we got Hamilton as well. I completely forgot about Hamilton Station. So yeah, what was it? Hamilton then Princeton Junction. So I'm slowly learning the stations on here. No, it was definitely Ham. Yeah, Hamilton, Trenton, Hamilton, Princeton Junction. I think. You just had the separate DLC items. Ah. They might put an article up about that, possibly. If not, I'll pop it in our server. You've done some rail fanning at Princeton Junction before, nice seven. There it goes. So a slightly shorter consist, but this is this one's going to be going down to Carolina. Um, I don't know what part of Carolina, but down to Charlotte, which I think it's in South Carolina. So I suppose it would get to Washington DC and then get a diesel loco on the front. Well you don't need you don't need to get the bundle, Krazer. I mean if you already own Boston Sprinter then well, just get them separately. Sounds good SNCF, yeah, not sure. Maybe it's not being added on there for some reason. All three very nice stations, awesome. <laughs> you found that Linden before, nice. Yeah, this is pretty. Oh, that was the uh, branch line there, wasn't it? There we go, there's the uh, branch line. That's a tiny little platform there. 
Hello, Pillars. She was driving last night on Boston Sprint, so lovely. Do full speed. We're slowly speeding up. See you, Will. Thanks for coming, mate. Enjoy. <laughs> See there, train boy. Yeah, we're uh, 79. So yeah, for tomorrow's stream, we're going to do the Acela, but we're going to do it in two parts. So we'll do probably Boston to Trenton, obviously using the two NET routes in the game. And try and, if we can, do the same service number. It depends really which year the timetables are set in. They might be different. But if not, we'll just do, do it, but different service number. Let's do one from a similar time. If, I need to have I need to I need to have a look at these arrow threes. I meant to have a look earlier. What are they are they actually like really old and arrow three train? Not car. Let's have a look. Oh wow, well that does look old. Is that New Jersey Transit? Uh yeah. Oh wow that that isn't <laughs> that is quite an old train. So did they used to run up the main line then, or? Wow. From the seventh. Oh, okay, not that. Well, oldish then. I mean, there's two coaches. Did they used to be the sort of main trains then? I suppose they're like the three one threes of the of NJT. Oh, see, Evan. Yeah, sounds good. Um, SNCF, that'll be awesome, mate, in the TSW chat. Yeah, so if anyone is trying to find the bundles, um, actually, I'll, I'll pop it in here as well, but do pop it in the Discord as well. I'll put a link on here as well. Actually, in fact, you, you could do that since if you want. Um, I'll pop one in as well uh, for the UK store. Oh, oh, where is it? Where's it gone? Why is it coming up with Battle Royale Super Bundle? So we got four miles to Trenton, so we'll be slowing down shortly. Right, here we go. Oh no, not just yet. It's loading. Yeah, so that, there's a link there. For the US Super Bundle from the UK PlayStation Store. And this is Hamilton Station. Must be quite a good one for watching the uh, trains whizzing through. 8 to 10 coaches. And we're off their limits to 80 miles an hour after a rebuild. They used to be able to go 100, but not anymore. Ah. Nice, uh, Evan. So what's the what's the North Jersey coastline? I've got it on Train Sim Classic. Just only well, not really ever played it properly. Is that similar or awesome? Poor hoods. Whoa, hello. It's getting annoyed with us. No one panic. So you've really got to concentrate in this. I suppose you've got to keep looking at that to see it coming down. There you go. All good. Don't panic. If you put it in suppression, it won't do anything. And it will come down again in a second, won't it? So you've got to be on the ball. And probably at this next signal it will uh, come down as well. Coast along like this for now. Oh, there you go, 45 now. Quick, in suppression before it bloody breaks. <laughs> oh, I see it then. Oh, wow. Oh yeah, coming up to uh, coming up to uh, Trenton. Uh, that's Penn to Long Branch Bayhead. It's similar, but requires a mode change if you're on a through train to Bayhead, or requiring a shuttle train to take passengers from Long Branch to Bayhead. Uh, then the line becomes diesel territory and runs to Bayhead. Oh, wow, well, 70 miles. Okay, it's quite a quite a long route then. No, trust me. <laughs> well, coming into Trenton. So that's one run. And then we're going to go back the other way uh, in the Acela. 
Then you have the Morris and Essex line to Dover. And how long is that? <laughs> oh, it's, that was an issue, is it? Uh, not silence and when put into suppression. I don't know what broke it. Uh, I just thought it did it until you got down to the right speed. I just remember Matt saying if you put it in suppression, it won't put the brakes on or the emergency brakes on. Uh, can yes, do that, SNCF. Give it a pin. So people can uh, find it. Oh, we're not coming up. I thought we were coming across there for a second. Not just yet. Beep, beep, yeah, there we go. Yeah, very good. Although I think I'd, I think I do prefer driving. Oh, down to thirty. Uh, I think I do prefer driving the Acela on Boston Sprinter, and the reason for that being it's 150 miles an hour for quite a long stretch of it, about half the route, possibly even more than that, is 150. So we'll do that tomorrow. Well, we'll do sort of two parts. We'll do the Acela on there, then come over to this route and do it on here. That was an enjoyable run. Takes sort of around 50 minutes or so as well. Not bad. About an hour in to end of the uh, fast, fast services. Or faster services. Yes, buzz, buzz. There we go. Yes, there. <laughs> and here we are. Oh, let's whack that up. And we did one of those services earlier. It takes about an hour and 37 minutes to do a full slow run from Trenton to New York Penn. So quite a, I mean, there's quite a nice variation of service times on this route. Yeah, you know, it's not just a route where every service takes like an hour, an hour, an hour and a half. You get a nice mix. I mean, sort of the short ones being 10 minutes. Um... And the longest ones being upwards of an hour and 30 minutes. And sort of the fast ones about 40, 50 minutes. So it's nice. Nice mix. Here we are. Sounds good, listen to you. Oh, we need to really slow down because otherwise we're going to... Go for a red, which wouldn't wouldn't be great. So a slightly quick approach, or slightly uh, fast braking. Awesome, uh, crazy dash. Well, I'll just run it on Boston Providence for now. It's like the fastest railroad in the U.S., isn't it? So makes sense. Run the fastest train on it. That was good. And yeah, Trenton Station. You've got the um, ALP 46 here. Which we haven't done on stream just yet. We have done it in video, in a video though. So we're going to pop into the Acela now and do some of that. When's the next one? There is something in three minutes. That could be it. Well, they'll probably go all the way through, don't they? To, uh, towards Boston. If this one's actually is an Acela coming in, Newark Penn, that's the next station. So it could be an Acela. Oh, it is. Oh, brilliant. Well, we'll just jump over there and hop in that. See you in a bit, Ricky. <laughs> Take care, mate. Yeah, let's go and do that. Perfect. Don't even need to uh, load out. Five right, people out the way. My train's here. Driver coming through. There we go. Thank you. And down on to... Let's, head, let's take the escalator. We're cool. Yes. Escalator time. Yeah, more than an hour, SNCF. That sounds about right, Brandon. Sounds about right. Pick up the uh, rubbish. Right. Here we are, the Acela. The, the most beautiful looking train on the route. In we go. And look, you can even sort of see all of this as well. So it's lovely. In we go. This has got a couple of minutes until it leaves. Out the way, you. There. Right, that's our train now. So this one's calling at New York Penn and New York Penn, and it gets there at 8.49, so 50 minutes to uh, New York, which ain't bad. There we go. Cool. It's 
weird though, the way all of this, all the way up to here, is about 20 minutes. And then from, no, hang on. Uh, where's... Yeah, from all, the, all of that route there, all the way up from Trenton is 20 minutes. And then from here, from Newark Penn to New York Penn, it's about 20 minutes as well. So sort of quick this bit, then quite slow this bit. Any PA mugs for collectibles? Unfortunately not. Let's go back there. Hello, Nabil. How are you? Uh, let's get that in. Looks like it's already set up for us. Tilting is already on. Um, that's fine. I think we're all good. And now we wait. This is the Acela, which looks fantastic. And this one is eight coaches. I'll quickly change my uh, reminder thingy. Eight. And it's eight. There we go, that's now set to uh, eight cars. Cool. Now we wait. What are the collectibles? I know two, there's rubbish and maps. I haven't found any others yet. Yeah, I had that earlier, Pete. I don't know what that's updating. Well, I'm sure the patch notes are probably out. Let's have a look. Let's get the doors shut. Um. Let's have a look. Are there any patch notes out for that update? Might just be a PlayStation one, possibly. Oh, no, there is a small update. Let's have a look. Um, let's have a look. Uh, access shows up on the HUD on all locomotives. Um, fixed collision at Harrison Station to prevent the player from exiting the playable area. Yeah, there's a whole plethora of fixes there. Um, I'll put the uh, link in the chat. So that is for the PlayStation update. Right. Let's go before we start rolling back. Let's get that up. We're off. Best train on the route. Back up to uh, New York. I thought we were going to spad then because that train was right there, but no, luckily we're coming across. There we go. So we'll be able to get up to 150 miles an hour on this service. Only for a short amount of time, but still, we'll be able to get up to that. And look, we're racing the other train. <laughs> That's fun. Our first race on this route. But labelled unavailable. Hmm. Screw you, NJT. We're Amtrak. We're faster. Awesome. Well, that can still get caught. I think that can go max speed of 100. It's doing alright, though. It's doing alright. Give him a good old two. There we go. There we go, look at that. Awesome. And get that right up. And we've got one three. Oh, there you go. It's up to what's that? 135 now, 135 miles an hour. So this is the racetrack part of the route. It's very quick. Let's get a flyby shot as well whilst we still can. We go ahead very quickly. We can watch it flying past. A little bit further, a little bit further, a little bit further. There it goes. Awesome. What's everyone's favourite train on this route, though? Is it the Acela? Or is it the ACS 64? Obviously, bear in mind, this is a DLC, the Acela. A DLC for a DLC. True, Evan. There we go. So, yeah, that's uh, Hamilton Station. It's so Princeton Junction next. LP multi-level for you, fair enough. Haven't played. 
I think for me it probably well on the base route if we take the uh, a seller out of the equation uh, probably the ACS 64 again um, but then if you add the SLA to the equation probably that then becomes the SLA fair enough train some world no not Sherman Hill Krasner how can that be your favourite <laughs> yes buzz buzz why did they increase to the price to 39.99 look around what hasn't gone up in price Food, drink, everything's gone up in price recently because of inflation. So, exactly the same for games and DLC. <clears throat> and that's it, there we go. Cane Creek, no. Definitely the Acela, but the NJT stuff is going on you. Fair enough. I think once we get those brakes spot on I might be like oh actually this is this is quite good but yeah those brakes are bloody um, horrible on there why can't they just put the uh, well brakes what the Acela or the ACS 64 have why did NJT have to bloody have uh, lapped brakes I just had to buy all of your advanced signals for some train journeys coming up. Another five returns at least to look forward to. Wow. Where about you heading there, NG? What's your next uh, tour? Yes, buzz buzz. Just got the Master Gen uh, free bus pack on Omsi for £8.99. Nice train some play through. Is that on sale at the moment? Yeah, this is the fastest speed on the line. This is we're coming up to 100. That's if we can even make it to 150. It sort of starts to struggle around 144. Oh no, it's no, it's doing it. You prefer the manual? You prefer the manual up in brake, personally. <laughs> they did SNCF. That's Princeton Junction. You actually had a uh, Amtrak in there, sitting there. And it'll be, what's after this? New uh, Jersey Avenue. Helps you remember them if you keep saying them out loud. Uh, London, Nottingham, Birmingham, Leicester, the next. Oh, we're all over the place then. UK wide tour. <laughs> I would get a fly by shot, but the free cam doesn't go fast enough. So we've got, we've got, we've got a. Well, it's still. I guess sort of a fly by shot. There you go. One of the nicest looking trains. Very much unlike the new Avalia Liberties, which just look stupid. Hello, TOC. Still got a book of train to Portsmouth, uh, but not on advanced signals yet. And a London trip in August. Lovely. Going all over them. And for the Isle of Wight, what you're doing. The Acela is fast. But why are Amtrak scrapping all of the Acelas? I mean, why? They're only like 20 years old. Aren't they still running perfectly fine? Why do they need to sort of scrap them? Maybe they could run them on other routes where uh, there's, I don't know, a shortage of stock or something. Must be a way they can sort of reuse them. They have slightly slower journeys, maybe. Yeah, Sifa. Not Sifa, uh, the Acknowledge, the Alerter. 33 miles to Newark Pen. Uh, you checked out the live stream preview yesterday and the Acela looks really good. You can't wait to purchase. Awesome. <laughs> Fair enough, NG. You're going to wait to download it on the PS5 version until the DLC limit fix releases. Going to play it on the PS4 version for now. Yeah, hopefully we do get an update on the... Um, 64 gigabyte limit soon. Oh, hello. Whoa, all right. Uh, don't panic. Don't panic. I'm slowing down. I'm slowing down. There we go. Don't panic, train. Now we've got 130 coming up actually. So I'll put that down as well. 
Yeah, the Evalia Liberty, isn't it? Essence here. Yeah, possibly, yeah, uh, Evan. Instead of having the cab car. Yes, buzz, buzz. It comes down very quickly. There it goes. More high speed. <laughs> and then back up to 145. Hey, Tintin, how are you? Hopefully you're all well. I should go back up. There you go. Hello, Munchies, how are you as well? Welcome in. Get that up, 29 miles now. So yeah, it comes down very quickly. We'll be there in no time. So we're getting that 32 past. So that is in well, about 22 minutes. Probably get there a little bit earlier if we're not following anything. And this will be the last stream of the day. Yes, Alerta. Have it. Uh, yeah, that's probably in the Elizabeth area, ladies and gentlemen. As um, Brandon said, there's a sort of a forced 45 there. So it's just a safety measure. Good to see you, just chilling, lovely. Have I tried free roam and stay on the train till it goes off the represented area? Yes. Well, not on this route, but on other routes. <laughs> Maybe. Let's pop that back. We've got a 130 coming up. So we should see that starting to come down soon. Well, I suppose the drivers in real life would sort of just know, right, 130 coming up, start slowing down before it actually tells you to start slowing down. A long section, though. You're curious, but we'll just say you've reached the edge of the zone, and that's it. That's already all what happens. Down to uh, 130. There we go. Yeah, buzz, buzz. And back up to 145. Is, it's always fantastic going at 145 in this. Nice and quick. That should go back up in a sec or not. Signal speed is still 125. Oh, there is a 125 coming up. That's Jersey Avenue. So we're coming up to uh, North Brunswick. we speed on through. Even the symbol of the Acela looks cool. Right, brother. There's a southbound service. I actually think this probably is my favourite part of the route, this bit. So I'm just flying over New Brunswick, uh, uh, North, North Brunswick. Ah, oh, this is cool. Sort of flying over it, going right through the centre of it. A nice station as well. Awesome uh, munchies. Hello, Ricky. Welcome back. And there was Edison after that, wasn't it? Yeah, Woodside's on there, although I don't think you can go to it. It's just on the map. I don't think you can actually go there. So I think that's the fastest part of the journey. Now I think it's 125 most of the way now to uh, Newark. We've done half the distance already. And we've got 110 coming up as well. So still quick, not slow by any means. Anything above 100 is quick.
Not that down. There we go. Thirty-two pass for Drew there, so we got to do twenty miles in eighteen minutes. Should be fairly easy, easily doable. Should be. I think this one's Edison, isn't it? And then Meta Chuton. I think it was after. And we've got a 110 coming up as well. So let's just start seeing that coming down soon. Should start coming down. When you get a speed reduction, the crew slows you down too slow. What's the correct procedure to slow down? Um, I usually just I just use the automatic brake and then do the cruise after. Oh, no. Oh, no, we're fine. You start doing the penalty brake then. I suppose you've just got to sort of know when to slow down. You've got to know where these speed limits are. Probably the best way to make sure it all works out nicely. You do, yeah. I'll pop that down even more. As we come up to the 95. I know you got Metro Park coming up, haven't you? It might be Met. No, it's not Metro Park next, or is it? Or is it Metatutin? Or Metutin? We'll see. Hello, Connor. I'm um, alright. Hopefully, you're all well. It's gone back up now to 110. Well, we'll go to 105 as that starts soon. No, yeah, Met uh, Metutin, this one. And then Metro Park next, I think. Yeah, it is, um, because lots of speed changes. Well, a few speed changes. Keep you on your toes. To make our way along. Let's get another fly by shot. Hope the speed doesn't decrease though. Yeah, not as easy as them. Um, it depends what train you're driving. Yeah, because Metro Park has all the corners, doesn't it? So that'll be coming up soon. Nice and quickly. How have you been finding the route, uh, Tintin? Just picked up the uh, seller today, loving it, lovely. Yeah, Metro Park. I must say, after Metro Park, uh, I keep thinking it's railway. I think it is. Maybe I'm right. <laughs> Could be wrong though. Still learning. And 14 miles to Newark Penn. It's not all that far now. And then after Newark Penn we got the slow bit into uh, New York Penn. Been doing some runs up and down Boston Sprinter. Lovely. Only done a couple of runs so far due to work, but love the Acela and the fact you get a long run on this. But you do, yeah. That's sort of 50 minutes on my, well, sort of 30 minutes non stop. Let's get that back, that back up. Got a 125 coming up as well. So nice and nice and swift. I 
You've got the bundle, you've seen the SL pass me, but not driven it yet. Well, it's probably one of the easier ones to drive, so... In fact, it probably is the easiest one to drive, because you've got the cruise control. Which helps out nicely. Do I like Sherman Hill? Well, it's a US freight route, so... <laughs> I'm not the biggest fan of it, but I mean, at some point we'll give it a go. I guess I'm sort of in the middle. I don't like it nor dislike it. It's just US freight, so it's more of a burden to do. But at some point we'll give that... Um, well, we did the Heritage Collection. That, that, that was good to do. But stream-wise, may, maybe at some point. Right, wait. Awesome uh, crazy dash. Look at that one two five coming up. Hello A one, how are you? He loves shirt. He prefers it to be him out. Yeah. <laughs> I mean, some US freight routes are all right. But yeah, I'm not not really the biggest fan. I like routes like this. So US passenger, quite quick, nice mix of uh, locos. Also, when US Roots comes out, we'll show them off and play them for uh, for a bit. But not particularly my cup of tea. Especially Sherman Hill, which is like two hours from one end to the other. But at some point, we'll do it. You say Cane Creek is king. Oh, yeah. And then Linden next. Linden, Elizabeth, North Elizabeth. Newark International Airport and then Newark Penn I think that's all we got um, on this section the weather's been quite nice as well on it you like mainland European routes oh, so you've got two coming soon then the Talbarn and Mans Coblenz which look both to be very nice There's another NJT service. Fairly busy. You both, you like both high speed and stopping? Fair enough. I like sort of high speed journeys which use classic lines. So like this, sort of quite quick but we're sort of on classic lines I suppose. But we really do need to slow down. Don't penalty bloody break me. There we go. There's another seller. Was you kill German once? <laughs> Fair enough, Burhus. Down to 80. If you put it in suppression, you'll be alright. Hello, Faber, how are you? <laughs> Doctor prescribes uh, Kane Creek and Sherman if you have trouble getting to sleep. It's a very, very good idea, Munchies. So this is uh, uh, Elizabeth coming up with the Elizabeth uh, Corners. They're coming down to 45, won't it? Hang on, yeah, we'll come down to 45, I think. Or is it not on this side? Maybe it's not on this side. Or is it? Maybe it's only on the southbound side. It has come down here, but not down to 45. Yeah, maybe it's only on the southbound side it comes down to 45, maybe. Hello, Marble Man. I'm right. Hopefully you're all well. Seems to be the case. That is Elizabeth and a North Elizabeth next. Got just over five miles to Newark Penn. But yeah, this train is a bit, well, it, it, it tilts, but only the passenger coaches tilt. So it's not really, I suppose, to get to a higher speed. It's just so the passengers have a little bit more comfort. Uh, but the power cars don't tilt. I mean, in the Avidia Liberty, does that all tilt? Or is that just the um, coaches on there as well? Then you've got North Elizabeth Station. It is thumpers, yeah. 
Uh, yeah, you can see uh, planes coming in to uh, land. Well, you can see them flying sort of over. And we've got a 70 coming up. Only the coach is still... What, and the new one? Wow. Uh, just got the South Eastern high speed route for Train Summer 2. Am I enjoying Train Summer 3? Well, yes. Nice uh, Train Summer guy, that'll be cool. Start bringing it down to 70 as we pass uh, Newark International Airport. Another airport station in the game. Well, you don't really see planes until you get a bit closer to Newark Penn. So that's the um, the flight path of them. That's coming down. Be a fun run. All right, uh, Cruiser. Yeah, Yes, buzz over. Hang on, where's that come out from? There we go. It's come down to 40, hasn't it? And the signal speed has. Maybe because we're early. Oh, we are a little bit early. Maybe that's why. It doesn't like us. <laughs> well, I think they yeah, approach medium. Yeah, there's a plane over there. Just over there coming in to land. Isn't it nice scenery? Yeah, it is. And it's quite distant as, uh, distant as well. If you sort of go up, you can see scenery. Well, actually, from here, not as much. But you can see sort of see scenery to the uh, I can see, especially over that side. Yeah, it's not just close and it's grass fields. It's so uh, you can see it quite, quite far away. Which is nice. Hello, exploring all UK stations. How are you? So the clocks aren't running late. I don't think they, I think we may actually be early for once. You see the Sopranos house. What's that? Where's that? Yeah, welcome to Newark Penn Station. 30. Alright, I'm coming down, don't panic. There we go. Pop that down as well then. Is this the route from the original train sim? It is. It is what we're on now. How does it take to do a full length from New York to Trenton? Well, in the Acela, about 45 minutes. Although, if you're doing a New Jersey Transit run, it can take about an hour and 35 minutes to do a full sort of slow run. Here we are. Looks like we're following something. I can see the signal change in there. Here we are. Back here again. We're in the Acela. We're in the Acela, Nora. They got another train coming in over there. This is the busiest section of the route. And I think that is supposed to be sort of the stop marker. Probably go past it a little bit. Uh well, if you're going from Trenton, Newark, Penn, which is our first stop in around... That's our first stop in 28 minutes. And then New York, Penn. That's it. <laughs> it's like it was trying to play approach slow, then flip to clear. Are we following something, or... 
Let's have a look. Oh, there is, yeah, there is something there. It's like a, um, I don't know what that would be. I want to say a um, Amtrak regional, but probably more likely. No, it probably is. Yeah, it's a regional service. An underground car park. I see what you mean. Yeah, lots of concrete, lots of pillars. So we've got four minutes here. Let's um, go for a little walk. Let's pop out, nice and safe. Uh, you notice the photographs on some of the AI trains aren't... Oh, pantographs, is that a bug? Yes. But, I mean, this is day one, so any issues will be sorted out. Let's pick up the rubbish. There we got trash. Trash cans filled. Filled them up. Um, there is a map somewhere as well you can collect. Um, let's have a look. Anything on this side? No, I don't think so. I don't actually know what the collectibles are on here. It's definitely a map and picking up rubbish. But that's all I've got so far. Amtrak North East Regional. Is there a glitch with the Acela doors? What would the glitch be with the Acela doors? Lovely coaches, though. Oh, hello. Let's open that up. All of the uh, bits and bobs. Very nice seats as well. Very nice. I like that as well. I'm just noticing it now, the way they look all sort of worn. As these are, well, these are about 20 years old. I don't know if they probably wouldn't be the, the exact same seats. But this way you can sort of see there's a bit of wear and tear on them. That's, all, that's, that's quite nice to see. Like that. I suppose this is the access, accessibility area maybe here. Here we go. Hello, CEO. How are you? They open way too fast. I don't know. Shouldn't you be going before you were late? We're all right. Make our way through. Have a little look at the different coaches. This is the quiet car. The best type of one to be in. Still really nice comfy seats if you compare it to uh, ironing boards you have nowadays. Very nice. Is there even a seat recliner? I think there is a little seat recliner. Bloody hell, this is like luxury. So we make our way through. Thank you for uh, choosing uh, Amtrak. Lovely. And they will open automatically as well. What's this here? What's that? Oh, that's the guard panel. I've noticed these don't uh, seem to come on. Maybe that's a bug as well at the moment. Yeah, but it says next stop. Let's open that up. So you can be guard on here. You can play play the guard, be, play being the guard. Let's actually give it a go. Let's get that in, and I suppose yeah, we'll wait. Wait a minute or so, and then we'll uh, Wi-Fi, and we'll give it a give it a close. Very nice round. Very nice. Certainly different to the Boston Sprinter route, which is more about sort of I suppose high speed. Whereas this, one's, this one's just a nice mix of uh, commuter and sort of high speed. And quite a nice length as well. Fair enough, BDL. Uh, no. No, there. Right, let's uh, let's get the door shut on here. Let's give this a go. Right. Uh, forward, close. Rear, close. Mind the closing doors. There you go, that's closing that. Cool, and uh, we'll do this one. Local close. Which is it then? There you go. That's that closing. Very quiet, the doors. Let's um, go into here again. And then we'll get going. So the next station is going to be uh, New York Penn. In nine miles. There we go. Let's go. God, oh yeah, maybe. We're off. Fair enough, uh, Ricky. We're off. Over the river. It does, doesn't it? All that's missing is the conductor standing outside. 
One of the best looking trains though. This is lovely. I'm being replaced by a weird looking train. Laughing stock. Let's get that up. There we go, up to 45. Horn. Proper loud as well. And that's quite a lot of the time on the older sort of DLCs. You do the horn, it sounded quite quiet. But I mean this, you can proper hear it. <laughs> it is noisy. Uh, if you had the Boston Sprinter route from Train Simile 2, does it automatically update? Well, if you're on Train Simile 2 trying to play it, then no, it won't automatically update. But if you've got it downloaded on Train Simile 3, then yes, it will automatically update. Then you have the updated signalling and just the usual Train Simile 3 bits and bobs, dynamic weather, volumetric clouds. I am 700, yeah, I am. It's a passenger route, electric as well, so it's right up my street. Let's get a uh, fly by shot. You might as well just set 60 on here. It goes up to 90 for a tiny bit. Pretty much 60 most of the way to New York Penn. No, I want to get a fly by shot. I just need to get the New York and a cellar, lovely. There we go. There it goes, as we uh, make our way this way. Yeah, so I have seen some AI services going down there, um, the New Jersey Transit ones, on our stream earlier, one with stuff down there. It's got a substation as well. Nice and slow. Speed 60. Uh, so it actually has gone up to 90, that comes pretty much down to 60 and only a mile, so. Um, well, we could speed up a little bit. Yeah, let's go up to 70. Just slightly faster. But not much point speeding up, though. Yeah, the pantographs don't go up at the moment for AI, but, I mean, it, it's day one. <laughs> so, you know, I'm sure... By the weekend, we'll probably have an update which sorts that and sorts of. I mean, we've already had an update on the PlayStation, which has um, fixed quite a few things. I think for PlayStation 4, and no, I'm, yeah, I think PlayStation as a whole, there's been an update. So updates are already rolling out for it. So I'm sure in fairly good time, the other issues will be sorted. I mean, that's just as the point of the special projects team to get updates out. ASAP after release. Being replaced in the Gateway project. Ah. It's quite slow, isn't it? Why though? Why why is this bit slow? Why is it 60 across here? Is it because it's a swing bridge? I mean do any sort of big boats actually use that nowadays through there? There will also be able building two new tracks past the Caucasus, nice. Well, I guess that means two new tunnels. But then what about the old Hudson River tunnels? Are they just going to be closed or sort of, well, <laughs> strengthened and made a bit more, uh, well, not crumbly. Outrageously old, oh wow. Let's get that up. Up to uh, 90. Not for long though. There we go. Cool. So another station near Cellar Passage. Let's uh, 
go ahead and watching it go through. Ah, oh, see, yeah, crazy. That's lovely. Oh my god, someone's a bit close to the edge there. Good god. That was cool. And it comes down to 75 soon. So we'll start sort of popping that down now. So let's always do it just slightly ahead of it. You think the cab signal ADU in real life has said that uses the colour position lights instead of what is shown in the game? Ah. I still think the easiest US signals to understand are the uh, Pennsylvania Railroad signals. They are easy. The Long Island Railroad, the signals on there are easy. And on Horseshoe Curve. <laughs> now you're getting them down to 60 as we go into the Hudson River Tunnel. Chatham Mainline and Trainson World. I'm sure Dovetail would like that. Because that's right outside their uh, HQ. That would be cool. I mean, part of it's in the game already. Doesn't always close back correctly to it and can cause delays. Ah, uh, got your Carreras. And into the Hudson River Tunnel while I'm crumbling apart. And on Sherman Hill. What do you mean on Sherman Hill? I'm going to have to uh, get them on. A little. Get the dynamic brakes on. Which for the dynamic brakes, if you're... Well, you put the cruise control on. Um, and I suppose, yeah, if you're going slightly above the speed of the cruise control then the throttle then becomes the dynamic brake it's quite smart hello Andrew how are you so down we go now we'll be ending up once we get here oh I see Evan nasty <laughs> it is quite slow into New York Penn but not as slow as Atlantic Terminal which is five miles an hour that's the worst one Grand Central is quite annoying as well but that's a bit more understandable. Yeah, buzz buzz, it's fine. We, we've done it. Good to hear Andrew, I'm alright. we got an approach medium. We are a little bit early, we're about six minutes early. Well, by the time we get in there, probably be about 45, so we'll be about four minutes early or so. So I would imagine we probably are going to come to a stop. Just because we are so early. And this takes us right into the heart of uh, New York. Quite cool if you think about it. We sort of went into the tunnels in quite a open, deserted area. And New York Penn's right in the heart of the city. Quite cool for... What does the timetable button work? Oh, well, let's quickly pop that down. The timetable, that's a good question. Brandon, <laughs> do you know or anyone? Time what does the timetable do? Timetable button. What did it bring something up on there? Not sure. I'm sure it does fan something fancy. The big apple, yes. Maybe, Evan. What's that saying? Restrict on there. It's got the white light underneath it though. So I think that means we can go through it. I don't really know the signals that well on here. Looks like you've got the um the bit uh, that what the hard on nine has, which says like stop, restricted, medium, limited, sixty, eighty, normal. Well that doesn't seem to be on this bit. So it's a centre console light for the de ah. Oh yeah, where you'd have your oh yes, where you'd have your uh I suppose schedule or timetable. Hello, Richie. How are you? Oh, nice, uh, Evan. Well, I think we're probably a little bit early, so it's just, it's just bringing us down. Yeah, 
Yeah, and what, on what part of the northeast corridor would that work then? It must be this area, mustn't it? Where it says where the SRML 6080M would light up. Oh, you should still be going like 45 or 30 here. <laughs> if a signal isn't all red, it is not red at all. That's, I suppose, a good way of thinking about it. Phone bus is one week away, it sure is. And what's that, Rich here? What's your typical question? And down to 15. That would activate on Metro North Territory. What sort would that be? The New Haven line. That line on this camera would be absolutely fantastic. New York to New Haven with um, Grand Central as well included up to uh, to up to New Rochelle. You could have the M8. Oh, only them in Metro North Territory. Oh, between New Rochelle, New York, and New got you. We're all good. How long is the ACS 64 on here? Seven coaches when we did before. Well, that was a slightly shorter one. Probably ten or so. Would be the same as Boston Sprinter. Yeah, we've got the Metro North route, and that's where they will come on. S is obviously stop. Uh, reduced is 15. Medium's 30, Limited's 45, or L's 45, and then 60, 80. Love the Harlem line. How long is an ACS 64? Oh, how long is an ACS 64 service? Uh, 55 minutes. Which is about sort of, uh, I think it's about 58 miles long, so about a mile a minute or so. That'd be awesome, Evan. The M8 would be particularly cool, because then you could do the um, power change over. I can't remember the station where you do it, but near uh, um, Mount Vernon East, I think it is. It's near there, isn't it? You do it. Now, I'm guessing we're going across to the right. Or not. This could go terribly wrong. We're not going through there. Well, that's just this is a red and a white, but that doesn't. That looks like a nasty signal. So I'm guessing no, because that train wouldn't be going anywhere, would it? Hang on, what? Where are we? Wait for signals. To show. Are we going to be perched on the end here, or or is that going to go out to like a or maybe that's going to Sunny Side Yard actually? Possibly. Don't want the nose going past the signal. Okay, well, right here then. Is it any good? Well, I'm going to say my usual thing, Richie. If you're liking what you see, then it's probably worthwhile. If you don't like what you're watching, then no. Um, oh, yeah, it's going now. Although... It is. You get high speed action, fast action, commuter action. So, there we go. That looks like we can go past that now. So, let's go. Just got to be careful. Is that one still red there? Whilst that one's going out. Hello, Caltrain921. How are you? Have your question marks? Lovely. Then I think there'd be a crew change here, wouldn't there? <clears throat> or is that only on the um, Amtrak uh, regional services? Northeast regional. <clears throat> As I remember on the NEC in New York, you had that really annoying like eight minute wait here at New York Penn. Which is right, old Faf. And here we are, arriving back into uh, New York Penn. 
about an hour and 45 minutes after we left. So sort of for a return journey on a fast service sort of gives you an idea of how long it takes. Now the old NEC went past here, past Sunnyside Yard, over the Hellsgate Bridge, uh, through Harlem and then up to New Rochelle. Bring it into Boston, yeah. There we go, let's get the uh, oh, door shut already. Stand clear of the closing doors. There you go. There we go, and that is... Oh, this one only goes as far as New York, I think. Yeah, this one says New York on there. Yeah, and it goes into the yard. Um, which we are not going to do. Um, I think we have to wait for that other train to go. Uh, but yeah, that is going to be everyone uh, for today's... Look at that, what a beauty. For uh, It wouldn't even make sense to add back because the SLA doesn't make any stops until Stamford. Uh, but yeah, that is going to be everyone for today's second uh, stream. We've done quite almost five hours on here today. Uh, hopefully everyone has enjoyed it. I'll see big thanks to Dovetail Games for giving us a key to show it off. Um, but yeah, what does everyone think? Is it good? Is it bad? Is you mixed? I don't know. What do you think of it? Uh, links can be found in the usual places. Discord, PayPal, Merch Store. Plenty of videos and premieres we did earlier. So if you want to catch up on some of them where we... Looked at the cab car, the ALP46, the Union Pacific Heritage Pack. Lots more content which can be found in the playlist below. I've actually made a separate playlist for the US Super Bundle because there's so much. Um, but apart from that, thanks for coming in. And I hope we'll see you next time in which we'll do a Just a Seller stream uh, on both Boston Providence and this route. But see you all and take care. Bye, guys.